The Food and Drug Administration lightened restrictions on blood donations by men who are sexually active with other men. Officials say this will make a big difference, especially now amid a nationwide blood shortage. KITV 4's Shanila Kabir has more on this story. The FDA loosened restrictions again for gay men who want to donate blood. The new policy is gay men who are in monogamous relationships can donate any time. The administration got rid of the time restriction policy, and many say this is a great step forward to fighting the national blood shortage. I'm all about equality and equity, and we're not hurting anyone. We're here to save lives. And as a proud Mahu, an L part of the LGBTQ Ohana, married happily to my husband for 14 years. The previous rule was gay and bisexual men could donate blood if they had no sexual contact with other men for minimum three months. Senator Hirono released a statement. I applaud the FDA for revising this outdated, discriminatory and medically unnecessary policy. This change is long overdue and will help save lives while also taking an important step towards LGBTQ plus equality. The Hawaii Blood Bank supports the FDA's decision. Officials there say we are in, quote, a situation we never want to see in Hawaii. The state is in critical need of blood, specifically O blood. It's challenging to import blood from the mainland, as you know, they have their blood shortages there as well. And additionally, you know, there's sometimes weather delays that in this time of the year, we can't move blood around the way we would like. But Hawaii can be self-sustaining and we can take care of our family here on island. The three-month restriction for gay men and their partners will be replaced with an individual questionnaire. Shanila Kabir, KITV4 Island News.